Hey sis, I'm gonna go play with my friends. Just a normal run of the mill day on the island. Nothing special or exciting happening to my knowledge. Uh, okay kiddo, have fun then. Oh, I will. <laughs> Hey everyone, welcome back to the cafe. It's time to sit back, relax, and enjoy an indie game. Today we're starting our playthrough of Little Lil Gator Game. Uh, we played the demo for this a while back. I've been really looking forward to this, particularly because it reminds me of one of my favorite games of all time, and that's A Short Hike. Uh, this is a very different story, but I think the idea of this small open world is really exciting to see other games take on. And also when I played the demo, I loved how this game embraced this idea of play and childhood. And so I'm excited to see what the full story is going to look like. So let's hop in uh, and, and hit start. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's enough laying around. I want to do something fun. Big sis will play with me. I wonder where she went. Oops. Here, let me, I accidentally hit the start key. There we go. All right, so no more laying around. Only fun, what a wobble. Wee! oh yeah, <laughs> this is fabulous. Oh my gosh, I'm such a cute little gator. Look at the wobble, 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 wobble. Oh, I could watch this little, this little buddy run all day. Oh no, the ground is lava, ah! Oh no, oh my goodness, nope, we don't wanna to touch it. We don't wanna to touch it. The ground is lava, and we have to only jump on these islands here, can we make it? Oh my gosh, that's so much fun. Aha, wahoo! <laughs> I loved playing that game when, when we were kids, Lava was like the game we played at the playground. And then it turned into this whole, like it was like all of the go girls in the class and the boys in the class. We had this big rivalry. Like it was, it was actually quite personal at the end of the day, I feel like. And this, this was like first grade, but it was, it was intense. It was very serious. Oh, big sis, big sis, big sis. I'm bored. What are you doing? Ugh, just looking at an article for that Legend of Hero game. Puzzles, monsters, the usual. No, I don't want to read about it anymore. Can't it be out already? I want to be the legendary hero. You and me both. Uh, but we don't need single player Legend of Hero. We want something we can play together. How hard? <laughs> Already the dynamic between like the brother and sister. I, I get it. I see it. I love it. How hard even is it to be a legendary hero anyway? You just need a sword and a shield. And a hat. Of course, a silly pointy hat. And you have to be clad in green? Hey, we got that box checked. I am green. Great, you're already halfway there. As a matter of fact, hold still right there for a minute. Oh, big sis, you're amazing. <laughs> I look so cool. It's like you jumped right out of the magazine. Now, as is tradition, you must choose a heroic name. Uh, what about Heroi Herosun Heromeister the Third? <laughs> okay, this is what all the NPCs are going to call you for the whole game. Your name can be as silly or as serious as you want, as long as it means something to you. <gasps> Every hero has a name! Oh my god! Okay. You know what? I, I, who am I to stop a little gator from, from his dreams? So, hero. Um, I already forgot what it was. Hero, son, hero, meist. Ah, shucks. Big Sis said I could be as silly as I want. Why can't I do more characters? Okay, Harrison the third. <laughs> That's our name. Is this the name you want? Careful, names can stick. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely sure. Hero Sun the Third. I am Hero Sun the Third, hero of a legend. Pleasure to meet you, Hero Sun the Third. Now I knew you need some kind of quest, but what? We need to get you up to speed, set the stakes with something dramatic. 
<laughs> or something. A hundred billion years of darkness. <laughs> a little over dramatic, but I can work with that. How about it all started 100 billion years ago? Oh my gosh. Oh, I love this. And can you look, the sun has sunglasses, which it always was the case when we were kids and drawing the sun. A brave hero set out on a quest to find something fun to do. With the help of their big sis, they made a whole fantasy game with rules and everything. They also made a pact to last all of playtime. No work allowed. But one day, after many playtime, big sis went away for school. <gasps> leaving the little hero to play alone. As time marched on, it seemed like the hero would never get to play with Big Sis ever again. Until one day... Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> until one day when Big Sis came home for fall break. Maybe now they could play again, just like they used to. Feels just like yesterday, huh? Oh... Big Sis is doing homework. <laughs> yep, those hundred billion years really flew right by. Kind of makes you want to jump up and do it all again right now, doesn't it? Well, I really have to finish this group assignment. Ah, oh, come on. You've been working on that all day. I barely got you to come out here with me. Yeah, sorry, kiddo. It's a tough project. Plus, I haven't heard from the other members in a while, so I'm having to pull a lot of extra weight myself. Ugh. But, uh, don't worry. I've had a punch above my weight before. This project doesn't stand a chance. Yeah, you're my amazing big sis. One little assignment is nothing. You'll finish this thing before we even know it. I believe in you, 100%. Oh. And now she'll never finish it in a million years. Dude, tell me at least that she looked at the decorations. Those took forever to pick up. It's not even a peek, but thanks for trying, guys. Oh, sorry, Heroes in the Third. I wish there was something else we could do. But it's okay, Joe. We all did our best. We could make monsters and treasures all day long, but we can't play the game for her. Avery, that's it. I'll play the game for her. <gasps> Gasp! They said it couldn't be done. Uh, care to elaborate? Right now, all this stuff we made is just loose cardboard. Lying around. Empty pots beside empty waterfalls that don't even have any cool secret caves behind them. There's no story, no drama. We need to put it all to use. A legendary hero, an epic quest. We have to show her what she's missing. Are you sure we should be trying to distract her from a school project? I've been doing college level work recently trying to get into that prep school. It's really hard. It's no problem for my sis, and it takes a million years, and I can't wait that long. She'll have like 10 million years to finish it later. I'm not entirely sure that math tracks. It tracks. Just a thought, but have you tried having a grown-up conversation with her about all this? You know, before attempting to gamify the whole island? We have a rule about that. No grown-up stuff during playtime. The only way to get her to play is by playing. Just enough to get her hooked again. Please! Oh, you already had me at drama. <laughs> I guess I can make my study break a little longer to help out. Well, if everyone else is on board and you really think this will help, I trust you. Yes, all right, let's get to work. Each of you will make a quest for me to complete and reward me with one of the hero items. Avery, your quest is for the hero's hat. Hat? Quest? Got it by... Martin, you'll handle the shield. Gotcha. And Jill? The sword, leave it to me. Exactly. And I'll play through the game myself to show my sister how much fun we're having. I'll do the quest, become the hero, and win over Big Sis. Sounds like a plan that might almost work, possibly. You're right. It will definitely work. That's not what I said. Don't 
worry, Scales. We'll ace this assignment for sure. Oh my god. The little pump up run. You know Heroes in the third has to get their their blood going, the energy up, the the muscles flexed. Hey sis, I'm gonna go play with my friends. Just a normal run of the mill day on the island. Nothing special or exciting happening to my knowledge. Uh okay kiddo, have fun then. Oh I will. <laughs> Okay, so we've got three friend quests. <laughs> Whoa! We're so cute. Okay, well, this is certainly a very breakable pot, but the only way to break it is to find a sword. So let's see if we can find Jill first. <gasps> oh no! Dangerous beasts! I need assistance, hero! Ahem. Oh, no, I didn't want to sit there. <laughs> you, hero, please, you must help. These vile creatures have attacked me, a defenseless NPC. Do you have a weapon, hero? A weapon? Oh, no, I am lacking my sword. Do you do you know where, where I can get one? Ah, oh, scaled traveler, I have heard many a tale of a mythical sword. The stories claim it to be hidden deep in the forest in a magic grove. Only heroes of true heart are able to draw the sword from its impenetrable base. That sounds difficult. Oh, I'm sure you can manage it. You're the hero after all. Please, you must retrieve the sword and save me. <laughs> oh no! Look at the dangerous beasts who have surrounded this poor, innocent villager. Please don't jump on the rocks. <gasps> A rebel is I. A rebel is I. I mean, technically, the rocks. Uh, well, I did jump on the rocks too. But also, stumps. That was just a stump. Please don't jump on the rock ledges. Disobeying all the rules. Oh my gosh, here it is. The magical sword. Thing, get, stick. But again, that's the fun part, right? It's like you find the perfect stick that's sturdy enough to swing at things and has a good hand grip so you feel good swinging things. Oh, priceless. I was actually taking care of my little niece who also is old enough now. She's like just over two knows the magic of a good stick. It's very, very important for play. Wow, the magic special sword, it's, it's a stick. Uh, I guess it was pretty short notice. Quick, I have to defeat those enemies and help Jill. All right, we found the sword. Wah, yeah, saba. Oh, oh boy, junk. I should probably hang on to all these bits and pieces of stuff I'm breaking. Maybe we can recycle it into something new. And probably because it's good to pick up uh, after after we litter in the park. <laughs> okay, so let's collect all of the crafty bits. Ha ha! Yahoo! Ha! Hey! Okay, we'll make sure we're collecting all the things. We're smacking all the stuffs. Oh! Secret monsters! I will get you all! But don't you worry, dear Jill! I have defeated many a monster, many a slime, and I will defeat these. Kapow! Wait, what? Kacha! Bacha! Ha! Hey! Help! Oh, is that all of them? Oh. Yeah, but what? What? What are you doing? Wow, super cool moves, hero. You have completed my quest. I mean... Yeah, thanks, but you're back to doing schoolwork. I thought you were playing. I am, I promise. Just trying to squeeze in a practice quiz in on the side. I'm a little stretched thin right now studying for that prep school. I don't want to waste any time. But the second you need me, I'll switch gears again. Okay, well, uh, see you later then, I guess. Sis, sis, check it out. Oh, <laughs> So cute. I found a special sword in the forest, and I rescued Jill from scary monsters. Very cool. Don't break anything. <laughs> okay. She loved it. Okay, what's next? Oh, I should check in on Martin. I think he's in the shady area. 
Martin K. Martin in the shady area. Kapow! Kapow! Peeking on sis. Still doing her thing. Okay, that's fine. I think it's so cute that in addition... Oh, we can climb trees. Ha! Huh. Okay, we can't jump all the way up. And we're not very good at climbing. We can hang on to trees. I guess that's, that's the more accurate way of saying it. Oh, I see a pot up there to break. Ooh! Thorns! Big on! Hiya! Wahoo! Birds! Okay. Let's see, what vantage point do we have? Look at Sis, so sad, doing homework, when she could be defeating skeletons! Hiya! What an awesome idea. Like, I kind of want to get cardboard cutouts and just create... <gasps> What's this? Oh... It's a memory of back when we were playing. I love this way that they represented like how experiences in spaces, like they stay in those spaces for you. Like no matter what, when you go back, those memories of actually doing those things in those spaces stay. Like for me, I cannot separate. There's this one like sort of overpass bridge um, that I did this dance project with. Uh, a group of friends and I remember we recorded this dance project on that bridge and we spent the entire afternoon there I had never been there before but now I live relatively close to that overpass bridge thing and when I drive by it every single time the imprint of the memories I have of that place stay there and this is such a nice representation of that for <laughs> Hiroshin the third you've got this Hiroshin the third uh, you sure? I'm pretty high up. Don't worry, the legendary hero can climb any height. Oh yeah, I'm a hero. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Okay. What were we doing? We were doing hero things. Uh, we have to go to the shady area. But really, I was just kind of wondering. We'll get to where we get to in a second. Hiya! <laughs> Uh, I'm just all about, well, this isn't the shady area, but that's okay. Oh, hey, Heroes in the Third. I've got the shield ready. Let me go grab it. What? No! You can't just give me things. It has to be a reward for a quest. Doing quests is the only way to become a hero and for my sis to play with me. Right. Talking to her is out of the question. Completely out of the question. We went over this. Playtime. No grown-up stuff. Quest. Drama. Fun. But maybe if that doesn't work, we can try talking to her. Too bad it's going to work perfectly and we won't need to. <laughs> Fine. We want a quest. How about a fetch quest? Fetch quests are the best quests. Oh, I mean, uh... I sure do love me a fetch quest. So go over there and grab that thing. I need it. For reasons. Huh. Well... Yes, okay, quest time! Wahoo! <laughs> oh, but look, there's a monster guarding the pot! It's time for the monster and its minion friend to be defeated! And we're gonna just, cl just clear the area, make sure there's no others that will impede our progress of getting this mystical pot! I got it! It's a pot? Weird, I wonder what Martin's plan for this is. I have a sneaking suspicion that Martin may not have a plan. Looks like Martin's just enjoying the, the afternoon. Here you go, Martin. I got the pot. Reward time. Whoa, amazing. You went over there and grabbed a thing and came back. Truly a task worthy of being called heroic. So here's your reward, hero. Pot lid? This is... Martin, this is the thing that I just gave you. No, it's not. It's your shield. Oh, uh, really? Yes. Wow, a shield. Amazing. In addition to defensive capabilities, it also makes a great sled. I can't wait to find a hill and slide down it on this pot lid. Uh, I mean shield. Well done, hero. You have completed my quest. Yeah, thanks a lot, Martin. Now go tell your sister you want her to play with you. Not gonna happen. Bye! 
Sis, I found this weird round thing. Weird, right? But my friend revealed himself to be an alchemist. <laughs> he transmuted it into a shield. Incredible. Yeah. Phew. Okay, all that's left is Avery. They've gone and climbed the mountain, haven't they? Ah. Ooh, shield. <gasps> Wahoo! What? Oh, that's so fun. We can coast on the water. And we can swim. I guess we're, we're, we are a little gator. So that makes total sense. Oops, wrong way. No, not the wrong way. I don't want it. I still have a quest to complete. Okay. Boop, ba doop, ba doop. Ba boop. Okay. Oh, I see. <gasps> Go! Whoa! <laughs> That's really cute. I wonder if I can hit the... Oh, no! What are these monsters doing here? <gasps> Defeat. Defeat. Saving my friend, the alchemist. Oh, I see. Okay, there's a timer. All right. So let's get ready. Wahoo! Cute. Okay. So we've got... Got our shield. We've got our sword. Now it is time to climb the mountain. We will begin. <laughs> this is so cute. Um, I love how bouncy that is. Now this mountain isn't any old mountain. It is filled <gasps> with strange plants. Carnivorous and dangerous to be sure. And pots. Very fun to bring. Oh, what was that over there? Ha! Huh. Hello! Who are you? Huh, where could it be? I couldn't find it anywhere. You're looking for Oh, you're looking for something? Yeah, there's a stick around here. It's my favorite stick. Uh... I feel like I left it right here in the center of this conspicuous opening. Uh... <laughs> I will tell the truth. It's their favorite stick. Oh, was that your stick? <laughs> Oops, I thought that was for me. My friend told me there was a sword hidden in the forest, and when I found that stick, it seemed perfect. A secret sword? Oh, that reminds me. When I was looking for my stick, look what I found. Oh! Whoa, a wooden sword. This must be what Jill wanted me to find. Thanks a lot. Do you want your stick back? Don't worry about it. You can hold on to it as long as you're enjoying it. See you around. Ooh, wait, so can we... Oh, what a fun UI. Um, okay, so just the fins. We do have the option between the stick and the sword. We're going to go with the sword. And we aren't able to craft anything, it looks like. Not yet. Oh my goodness. Look at these monsters that have cropped up. Oh, this is this is the big boss. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> and what is a hero without getting rid of the weeds? Uh, okay, we've got more weeds over here. I think wasn't there a pot? Ooh, well here's a different pot. Waha! Okay. Let us focus back in. We need to go and get Avery, I think it was, the last person. <gasps> oh no, except we found a den full of so many creatures. Okay, so there's our sword, or where we got our sword. <gasps> oh, look at this. Another memory. Destroy the water! Ah, it's so slippery! Oh no, the water has evil in it! I love that. Oh, hello! Huh, hello! Hey, have you seen? 
It is I, the bracelet shop. Look upon my array of beauties. <laughs> Do you not desire them? Covet them? Hmm? Tell me, what is it that you truly want? I can't help but sway. Um, I'm looking for my friend Avery. They're a frog. Yes, the energetic one. They have ascended to greater heights. But do not fear, for you can follow in their footsteps with the help of my bracelets. You're saying a bracelet will help me climb cliffs? They are bracelets of power. They imbue you with strength. The strength to keep going, to tell the world who you are, to ascend over your every obstacle, to hold tight in the truth in your heart. Okay, okay, I'll take one, fine. Oh, oh, as I thought, you desire bright bracelets more than anything else in this world. Mayhaps I could be persuaded to part with my beauties for a price. You carry confetti and cardboard in tow, no? You want the scraps of our broken crafting stuff? But it's just a bunch of junk. Harrison, come on. Er, here, Harrison. Hero son. You know the game. Play. Ah, but they hold value to you, do you not? Then they also hold value to me, because I can take that value away from you. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, so I will absolutely spend power bracelet get. With only one, my stamina is pretty low. With more, I could climb longer. Okay, well, here we go. I can buy three more. Oh, wait. But I have to find you. Oh, that's fun. Okay, well, we're going to continue to collect confetti just for the next time we encounter our bracelet friend. Please don't climb the cliff face. Wahoo! Well, I have never been one to work with the rules. Uh, hello, fellow mountain climber. These bracelets sure work great, don't they? Uh, I guess so. Doesn't make a lot of sense to me. They're just bracelets, right? Might be placebo. Not a chance. I myself, of course, am a proficient mountain climber, but when that frightful character told me that they could help, you bet I bought one. Heck, I bought four of them. Now look at me. I can climb anything. Go anywhere. You, fellow mountain climber, we will have a climb off. I will traverse this mountain and hide amongst its peaks. If you think your meager one bracelet is good enough to match my abilities, prove it and find me amongst the mountains. Okay. Challenge accepted. Boop. Aww, little gator. Oh, I could maybe use some help here. Uh, hey, yeah, I'm kind of stuck here. Could you help me out? What happened? Hold on. I'll break you out of there. Okay. Phew. Freedom. Yeah, what the heck happened? Well, I was just standing here minding my own business, meditating, eyes closed, completely motionless, blending in with nature, when suddenly these pieces of cardboard appeared out around me. Oops, that's my fault. Me and my friends place these all over the island. Guess we got carried away. <laughs> Sorry. There is no need to be sorry. Would have broken out myself, but after staring at the designs of these creatures long enough, I fell in love. The simple, elegant shape, the exquisite color, the lifeless eyes staring into the void. I can bring myself to harm such an image. I only wish there was a way to bring that image to life. <sighs> if only. Anyway, I must take my leave. Oh. Okay, well, if we run into each other again, maybe you could help with the game. Hmm, mayhaps. Only time will tell. Oh. Hmm, slimes have quite a look to them, huh? They are very good-looking slimes. Oh, I can climb trees now! Oh, I couldn't before because I didn't have the bracelet. <laughs> oh, sneaky slime right there. Okay, and I know it would be quite fun to just jump down and into the ocean, but I have something to do. I have goals to achieve. We're continuing to climb the mountain, keeping our eyes open for the other mountain climber. Okay, it looks like that's the way we came. We're gonna keep a going. <gasps> oh, this one's cute. I destroy. Wahoo! Oh, I love that we can hop onto the fence. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. Oh! <laughs> These are so cute. 
Oh my goodness, these little golems, these little rock shards. Oh! oh no, we have fallen, but that's okay because we have discovered more monsters to defeat. Oh. Oh, this is the waterfall. Oh. Defeat the grass. Oh. Is that another, is that my friend or is that another? <gasps> hey, it is my friend. Oh, hey Harrison the third. Uh, wow, um, what is all this? Something to spice up our game and impress your big sis all at once. A restaurant, these create lots of conflict and grown-ups love conflict. Do they create conflict? A restaurant, conflict? See? There will be an opposing restaurant that badmouths them to the press. And then in Act 2, all the refrigerators will mysteriously be plugged overnight. The drama! With all that spoiled food, how will they impress the food critic? Not to mention all the interpersonal tension between the chefs. Uh, uh... I don't know, all this conflict is a bit stressful, don't you think? Oh, stressful? Yeah, uh, it kind of feels like grown-up stuff. Doesn't it? Oh no, not grown up stuff. Forget I ever said anything. Don't stress aloud. Whoop, there it goes. Oh no, I didn't mean for you to wreck the whole. I, I feel kind of bad. So, the hat, right? Did you at least make the hat? Right, the hat. Um, to be honest, I forgot everything you were talking about the moment I left. But you seem to have a pretty clear idea of what you want. Why don't you make the hat yourself? But, but it needs to be a quest. Can do. Hero, your quest is to craft a hat. There we go. Simple. <laughs> the little smiley face. Um, oh, <laughs> poor, poor little gator. Make the hat, hero. I just make it? Yeah, you've been collecting stuff, right? Cardboard, confetti, shattered ceramic. I bet you can make a hat out of that. Okay, well, I guess let's see. Aha! Uh -huh. Pointy flappy thing. It's pointy. It flaps around. What more could you want? So we could craft that. Oh, we could also craft the perfect disguise for slime conventions. Oh, we're gonna make both of them. Oh my god, that's cute. But the classic. Hey, that wasn't so hard. I made a hat all my own. Quest complete. Oh, I mean, almost complete. I have to show Avery first. Whoa, what an excellent heroic looking hat. <laughs> Thanks. Does this satisfy your quest then? Oh yes, absolutely. And even better news, I remembered something about the game. It has a glider. It makes exploration so easy. A glider? The ones I played didn't have that. Oh, well I must be thinking of a different game in the series. Anyway, hero, for fulfilling your heroic questing duty, I must reward you. What reward? But I already have the hat. Hero, I must depart. Please take your reward as I leave you. Goodbye! A glider? Is this a shirt? Avery, wait, whose shirt is this? <laughs> I guess this must be the glider they were talking about. I mean a, wow, a glider. Simply jump again in the air to glide. Sis, 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 I ventured to the top of the mountain. I had to climb all over and at the top, a special hero hat. Oh, looking sharp. Yeah, that's everyone, Ew. Okay, okay, okay. All that's left is to go recruit my sis. I'm ready for this, right? We are. I mean, there's still monsters to defeat, side quests to run. There's so much here. Whoop. Now, will we be able to get to the top? That's the question. Wahoo! Oh, I see. Do you see the little running figure over there? I bet you. Wahoo! <laughs> the little leg kicks are extra cute. Okay, we'll be able to get up with our one measly bracelet. Aha! Ah, oh, fellow mountain climber, you have found me. What took you so long? I bet you think you're quite the hotshot now, having traversed these treacherous cliffs. Little do you know, you have a lot to learn. You have learned the art of ascent, yes. However, you are quite lacking in the art of descent. Allow me to demonstrate. <laughs> what? I'm good. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
So have you learned from my example? I, uh, I guess. Ha! Huh, it requires much practice to achieve this level of mastery. So go and perhaps one day you will measure up to my abilities. <laughs> oh my gosh, the ragdoll physics. So cute. Oh, I don't have enough. I probably need... Oh, maybe I can climb maybe from here. Yeah. Wow. Here we go. The treacherous cliff. The mountainside. Oh my goodness. We made it. Climb, climb, climb. Um, But don't tell anyone I let you. <laughs> The hero beats the mountain. I did it. We should do this every year. No, every month. Every day. Oh, look. And we, that's... Oh, we had a chest. I don't know if I can open it. Ah, there we go. I can. Wow. I love the way that it, as you go further out, things just turn into this beautiful gold fall feeling day. All right, well, I think I see sister over there, so wha-pow! Let's go! <laughs> oh, there's all my friends! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wahoo! Go for it, Harrison the Third. Playtime is now, and conflict is just grown-up stuff. Your sister's gonna love it. Oh, my friends are so encouraging. Everything's been meticulously prepared. Now talk to your sis. I'm sure she'll have time to study later. Well, you at least look like you were having fun. So I guess that might be enough to convince your sis. Um, those selfies look super fun. So, what'd you think? Just a sec, let me finish this thought. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And... Done! What's up? Whoa! You're done? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm nowhere close to finished. But I've got a minute. What do you need? Well, look at me! I'm the little green hero! And all those quests I've been doing is just like the game we played. Oh, yeah. You sure have been busy. Yeah, it looks fun, right? Oh, kiddo. Yeah. Just like old times, right? Kiddo. I think it's great you're playing with your friends, but I've really got to focus on this project. Still? But I'd... I did all this stuff. Well, why'd you agree to come if you weren't going to spend time with me? Remember our promise? Playtime means no grown-up stuff, right? Kiddo, I... Maybe you're right. I guess I'll just... Get out of your way. No! The literal opposite of thing I wanted to happen. Go ahead and have your fun without me. Oh. Well, so much for a legendary quest. Oh, sorry, Heroes in the Third. I guess it wasn't meant to be. What? <laughs> no way. <laughs> Didn't you see that spark in her eye? All I saw was the bags underneath them. I'm telling you, we almost had her. We just didn't wow her enough. We need to go bigger and better. We need to go there. Oh, the big island? Imagine all this, but over there? A bigger forest, a longer river, a taller mountain, an irresistible adventure in every direction she looks. There's no way she'll be able to say no. What do you say? Uh-huh. Oh, see, my friends, they're not... They also seem to be more concerned with some of the real-world, grown-up school stuff that my sister's also concerned with. <sighs> I don't know, dude. The entire Big Island? That's not what we signed up for. Honestly, I'm exhausted from working on just this one. Oh. Hey, Joe, aren't you supposed to meet up with your school group soon? Oh my gosh, you're right. What time is it? Oh, I hope they don't start without me. Sorry, Scales. I'll see you later. I, well, I gotta get going, too. Some guys are expecting me at the splash pad. Good effort, team. Oh. You're gonna be okay? Um, yeah. I'll be fine. 
Don't worry, buddy. Maybe we could win her over next fall. Or maybe not. Bye. <laughs> oh, into the, into the depths. <sighs> now what? Ugh, who's texting me? Tom. What's good, Heroes in the Third? You coming or what? Tom, coming where? You were waiting. We were waiting for you at the island and you didn't show. What? No way, I'm on the island right now by the playground. Wave at me, I don't see you. Tom, that's the big island. We said to meet on the little one. Oh, my be, my be. Elmeo, I was out here like, where are these guys? Cool news though. I texted like everyone and a bunch of peeps came out to help build stuff. Really? That's incredible! Yeah, but y'all weren't here, so they wandered off all over the place, lol. Oh. I don't think they're still doing the game, though. Just in their own... Oh, I think they're still doing the game, though. Just in their own space, I guess? Oh. Yeah. DW got big charisma. You go, you can round him up no problem. I'll send anybody you meet on the little island an invite to. Great, thank you. This is amazing. We could really make an island-wide game happen. Oh, whoever Tom is, I'm like, I'm so happy that Lil Gator has friends that are still in this sort of same mindset of wanting to play. And the fact that they're bringing other people in on it too is really exciting. It's like they understand, um, Tom understands sort of this hope that Lil Gator has and what they, they want to achieve. Not simply just playing with their sister, which that's the main goal, but this idea of like bringing people together just to enjoy and not talk about grown-up stuff in school, but just to have fun outside. And on a beautiful day like this, why, like, why would you do work? But listen, come meet me at the playground first, because I got big ideas for decor. I'm next to the Blinky Radio Tower on the big island, not the little one, la 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 la. <gasps> oh, Tom. Cool, cool. I'll be there soon. Okay, okay. Eyes on the prize. Heroes in the third. It's not over yet. All you have to do is go corral a bunch of strangers and turn them into your friends. Find Avery, Martin, and Jill and convince them to get back on board and compose a dramatic spectacle the likes of which the world has never seen in a single afternoon. Easy. This will be a walk in the park. Oh, and I shouldn't keep Tom waiting at the playground. Time to head for the radio tower. Hey, big sis, better grab a laundry basket, because I'm about to knock your socks off. Oh. Well, here we go. There is achievement unlocked called Change of Plans. We are going to the big island. But that'll be in the next episode of Little Gator Game. Today, we are finished here. Um, let me know what you think of this game. And I'm really curious what your favorite childhood games were to play. Lava was a big one. Um, we had Red Rover, but that was actually banned because too many kids got like sprained wrists and really bruised and injured from that game. Um, it's where you like all held hands in a line and you would yell, Red Rover, Red Rover send, you know, Kim Chica right over. And then I, as Kim Chica, would run over and try to break through the line of kids and yeah you can imagine like just lots of injuries but we also really loved playing um my brother and i especially we loved having our toys and just playing pretend whether it was in our room or outside in the yard we would just play pretend with them and i i really love that this game is making me think back to that and so maybe i'll text my brother about it <laughs> um but yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this, and if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed this channel, find me elsewhere. Um, I'm on TikTok and Twitch, as well as here on YouTube, all under the handle Kimchika. And like here, I really just want to help you find your next favorite game and celebrate the games that we're playing right now. Um, so let me know, let me know what you think. And until next time, seeing you in the cafe, I hope you have a wonderful day or night wherever you are, and that you're finding lots of games to play. Bye!